get out the way Who got a watch, who got the time, I'm raising the clock Even in my feelings, grind don't stop Got big dreams, want big rocks I got plans, who got talk Heard it's real cheap, but it's really cold calls I'm trying to get these ends Building bios with my friends I'm about handling my business No time for stress over bullshit You think success is a option Okay, Miss Bobby Anna, Miss Bob Hey guys, welcome back and to the vloggy vlog, we are just about to leave the house. Like, this vlog was supposed to be started, like, since high day. It's night time. And it is a Thursday. I'm going to an event. We got invited to an event by um, Women's College Hospital. And it is a Black Women's Health Summit. So I felt really honored to be invited. Not because I'm a Zatsa, but because... It's gonna be, oh my God, is this side lifting? Oh yeah, we're gonna need some glue before we leave. Why I'm honored is because it's everything black women's health, um, getting statistic and all of that. And it's important because I get to share information with you guys. So I'm super excited for that, especially since you guys know I've been dealing with a lot of new to me health issues when it comes to my skin my immune system and i also got some news like two weeks ago but right now i'm not in the mind frame to talk about my diagnosis but i will share it with you guys because it's something really important that you know sharing conversation might help especially since i've heard about it but being diagnosed with it myself it is new and it's something that I'm learning about every single day and that this event is going to help tremendously talking to actual doctors about it. And also I'm going to try to see if I could get a black female OBGYN because I have a black um, primary care physician, but an actual OBGYN. Yeah, I need that. Y'all, y'all been telling me, Chevy, you need to drive. <laughs> I said I was going to get my license this year. I mean, the year isn't done yet. I could still get my G1 in Canada. That's like a driver's permit type thing. So the first step is getting G1. And then I take some classes. And I could get my G2 and my actual driver's license within eight months. The Uber is like on the block. Okay. Um, Do I show you my outfit or do we just go? Okay. So outfit check. I'm wearing this turtleneck top from Zara. The pants is also from Zara. I lost a little bit of weight in my um, mid region right here. So I need the belt to help with the gapping in the back. And since I'm wearing this Gucci belt, I'm like, I gotta wear this bag because I haven't worn it in so long. So I'm wearing this Gucci bag as well. For heels, we're wearing black heels. And I'm wearing this oversized black leather jacket to complete the look so yeah so my uber is here so let's get out to advancing equity and working hard and working hand in hand with communities today is really special Black Women's Healthcare Summit is all about allyship and advocacy and action. It's about coming together to make a difference in the health of Black women, their families, and their communities. So I want to thank each and every one of you for being here. The majority of the type of trauma that I work with is mostly childhood sexual abuse, namely incest. That's not a normal occurrence. So oftentimes my patients feel like something is wrong with them because of it. And so there are actually six symptom categories that encompass what we call complex PTSD associated with untreated mental illness and pregnancy. The baby is then at risk of not making it. We know that infant mortality is high. Then, but if they do make it and have a mother who is dealing with mental illness on or including untreated trauma, then that has an impact on how the baby develops. So we have, we need that data to better understand what are the outcomes right now 
and how can we intervene and prevent these outcomes? So, hey guys! Hi. My name is Jason. I'm a big chef before. <laughs> I met the sweetest person ever. It was such a good time here it was, with you. It was such a surprise. I such know. A surprise she She's from Dominica, you know, the Caribbean. Caribbean massive. We gotta link up. We gotta link up. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> it's a new day, a new dawn, a new ride. Um, yesterday we went to the Black Women's Health Summit downtown Toronto. And I wanted to talk about the summit, but you know what? You need to talk about something serious, but you're not in the mental space or headspace right this second to talk about it. So I'm gonna give you guys like like a full rundown of that experience because if you're a black woman, you know what it is like to get proper basic health care. Okay? You you know, you've had an experience just know you're not alone we've had the experience especially for the last two years for me I've talked about it in my blogs a lot um so today we are about to do a wig video because we are going on a last minute trip next week I honestly said I wasn't gonna go anywhere major for the rest of the year I was cooling out because we have a massive trip in January but um, because of unforeseeable is that the word we, we got to go on this trip so it's gonna be a quick trip next week so I need to you know catch up on some stuff that I need to do before this trip so we're gonna do a wig video I'm gonna do what am I gonna do today I think I'm gonna do RPG hair um, they sent me this really pretty curly hair so we're gonna try that out we're gonna style it it's curly it's big so I'm gonna do the whole shebang and I also want to do I'm a makeup video for you guys I haven't done one of those in a while um right now I am trying to get my skin together the texture the spots the acne spots all of that stuff so that's what we are working on um i started the dr dennis yes dr dennis treatment it's for textured skin so i started that i want to say it hasn't been a full week yet but i'm going to say i did four treatments already it's a pack of 30 so we're going to do the whole 30 and see how our skin looks a month from now like my skin doesn't look too bad what i want to do is get rid of the acne scarring and stuff and I had this year I had really I wouldn't say really bad acne because it wasn't like super terrible but it was a little bit more than I was used to and then I found out that I had PCOS so that was a contributing factor so that's why I'm working out way more now trying to eat better cut that sugar do all them stuff that I'm supposed to do that I was lacking so it's a lot. So we even got to talk about that, honey, because I, I just can't. I just can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. So anyway, child, let's, let's get this work on the road. Tell me why I bought a whole new camera, like brand, brand new, like new, 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 just came out this year. And I'm still using my old camera because I am so attached to my 90D. I got the R8. It came out either this year or early last year. Matter of fact, I think it came out this year. I got this new, super sophisticated camera, compact and everything. Canon is like one of the best cameras they've ever made. It doesn't have a flash though, which I think is so icky. But it's a brand new, one of their best camera yet. Full, they call it full frame, everything. And I just have not grown to love this camera because I haven't taken the time out to actually like fall in love with it and find out how to properly use it and I paid so much money for that camera and lens for the camera and the lens I paid over three thousand Canadian dollars and it's just sitting here that's like ridiculous because I wanted to upgrade the video quality but I am so 
I can't seem to let this 90D go. Oh, this is my baby. I can't. And it's not even about letting it go because it takes a really good... I do really good content with it for my um for my TikToks, like makeup video and get ready with me. Like, so it's not like if I went ahead and used the R8, I'm gonna get rid of this because I'm gonna keep it. But for my YouTube videos, not my vlogging. I can't get you know what? I actually bought the R8 to vlog. <laughs> and I used it in the Bahamas. And there was a lot of clips in the Bahamas video that I just did not like. So I think I need to work with the settings. But what I'm using to vlog right now is called the um, Canon M6 Mark II. Love it. I'm, I, I just can't get away from these two. They're like cousins because they're so much alike. And the R8 is supposed to be the super upgraded version to the camera that I'm using right now. But... I haven't gotten that from it yet and I guess it's because I haven't taken the time to actually like you know work with it hey Google Pause the music. Yo, I love J. Cole. Like, love. When is J. Cole touring? When is the album coming out? Like, J. Cole, I wanna know. Okay? I wanna know. I'm done with my hair. Oh my god, laid for the gods. I tried something different and I was like, why didn't I try that a long time ago? So I decided not to wear a wig cap and the install looks so much more flawless without a wig cap and it's less work to do because i don't have to hide a wig a cap i love it so right now we're done we're going to do a makeup tutorial so i got my stuff in front of me i just packed everything in my little travel stuff so i could take it downstairs because i felt more comfortable and settled in this room to do um a makeup tutorial mm -hmm. We got the camera set up and everything. I want to change the lens though. I'm going to change the lens to the lens that I usually use in my, um, in like my Zara haul and, um, what I wore on vacation. I just love the look of that lens. So we're going to use that. But yeah, the wig is cute. The skin looking nice. Like, the skin isn't looking too bad. We still got a little couple of areas to work on, but it's coming along. I'm not mad at it. I mean, perfect imperfections like hello hello <laughs> so yeah so we're gonna do this tutorial and then um i'm probably gonna clean just a little bit for tonight get my stuff together because it's gonna be a busy weekend we're going to the mall tomorrow and i have my friend's birthday um birthday dinner tomorrow and i wanted to create content because i found this outfit on pinterest and mm, chef's kiss and i got the pieces together and i'm excited to put it together and see that vision so i need to make sure that i do a reel a tiktok a youtube everything like content galore you feel me so let me go do this and then i'm gonna come back to y'all in a minute we already did the hair video we did the makeup video now we're doing a sponsored video and I'm just trying to make sure I get all my work done. So these are the lip gloss that we're trying out. And I'm doing a little TikTok Instagram reel situation. And it has been a very full night. Like I ain't even playing with y'all. Okay, I like this color. This color is pretty. It's giving fall pumpkin spice. Now we gotta do the lip action. <laughs> Y'all don't even see what I'm doing. I'm like over here like my little camera. Oh shit. Recording has been stopped because card is full. Well, that's unfortunate. So I'm gonna have to use the memory card from this camera this vlogging camera so i'm gonna put y'all on pause so 
So I need the memory card for this to use for my other camera so that we could finish this up. But okay, this lip gloss is kind of cute. Not even kind of. I don't usually go for colored, colored gloss. But this is very pretty. It is a very pretty indeed. Okay, I'm, I'm going to get with y'all in a second. But I'm going to need to borrow this memory card. I'm so sorry. I truly believe this is it for me for the night because I am exhausted. Not exhausted, just exhausted. Just tired, child, I'm tired. I'm tired, I wanna take this wig off, I wanna take this makeup off. I wanna go lie down, I wanna eat some food, I wanna watch some TV, but I can't because I need to go edit and my head is about to explode, but still we move. Tomorrow's gonna be a busy freaking day. And I hope I have my shit together. So I'm going to make sure I get enough rest today. Because tomorrow's going to be busy. I have to get my toes done because the outfit that I'm wearing. I just remember that I'm not wearing boots with it. I'm wearing um, sandaled heels. So I need to get my toes done. Usually when winter is here and I wear a lot of boots, I barely get my toes done. But I'm wearing pantyhose with the outfit. Even, even though your toes still going to show through it. And my toes look atrocious so i'm gonna have to squeeze in a pedicure on top of everything else i need to do my shoes isn't coming in time i ordered the sh um shoes from steve madden i paid extra for the express shipping it said one to two business days but why is it coming next week tuesday if i ordered it on wednesday couldn't be zara if it was zara i would get it like the same day so there's that um, so I'm going to have to either go in store, get the shoe, and then when I get the other shoe, I return it. Or I just get a completely different shoe. And then Monday, no, Sunday, I'm going to have to pull up my hair, wash it, and then I think I'm going to do soft locks, short, shoulder length soft locks with a lot of curls. I want a lot of curls in there. So I had this idea to do a video like that. I'm like, I have to do it. I want a lot of curls in there. So it's going to be like this length full full soft locks and just a bunch of curls like i want it to be as big as this like overly done maybe not super overly done but that would be a really cool protective style video so we're gonna see how it goes Piling paper got them talking nice to me down the bottle it be going right through me brown baby down to take a flight to me they think that I'm stunting, but it's slight to me. Piling paper got Guys, we are in Jamaica. Like, how did we get here? <laughs> how did we get on this random, this random trip? We are in Kingston, Jamaica right now. I am here to visit my friend. It's not going to be a vacation, like one of them vacations. You know, like them vacations I take where I'm like, Oh my god, drone footage, we at the beach, you know, we here and there and everywhere. It's not one of those. I'm trying to figure out how to turn off this park in this Airbnb. So I'm staying at an Airbnb. And the Airbnb that I'm staying at is pretty cute. It's not like the one that I visited the last time. I really love that one that I stayed at last time, but it wasn't available. But this one is really nice. So I have my friend staying with me. So we got our um, other beds. And this is a bathroom. It's pretty clean, pretty decent. Um, and then this is the little dining area. Then we got the living room area with a TV. I really like this TV because it connects to anything on my iPad and my phone. Like I, it has this app on there, this casting app. And even if it's just the simple internet, um, on my phone on my um, iPad it connects to it and I'm loving that now we got the kitchen the fridge ain't nothing up in this fridge because you know I just came last night and I just got a little few stuff because hello Jamaica hello expensive Ooh, it's over. oh my god is that broken Jamaica is so expensive like not even playing I'm like how y'all surviving because I went to the grocery store, even though I be complaining about the grocery store in Toronto too, because let's face it, we're in a recession. Everything is expensive. 
but yesterday I was trying to like I didn't want to get like food food because I'm really not gonna be here this long I'm probably gonna be here for like five days tops so I didn't want to get food food and waste it even though I'll just give it to my friend and whatnot but I don't want to cook I didn't want to do anything like that while I'm here um so I just wanted to get like quick instant type food so I got like instant oatmeal to make in the morning because I didn't want to move too far away from my diet so I didn't want to just come here and eat just terribly and um so I got that you know like a little pastry and stuff I didn't want cooking food I wanted I also wanted fruits because I love fruits that's what I like to snack on but but why it is that a little they have this little tray this stir foam tray and they have grapes on there. I could count the grapes. I don't know how much it was in there, but it, it was just a handful of grapes. It's not like the bags that you get at like your um, Whole Foods type store, like a whole bag of grapes. The most I've ever seen grapes for at home was like $8. And I'm like, mm. even with the $8, I'm like, no, I'm not buying grapes for so much money. Even though sometimes, depending on how, how well produced the grape is, I will pay a certain amount of money but they had the grapes in just this little tray you can count how much grapes handful of grapes it was like a thousand plus jamaican dollars so that's like probably like 10 over 10 dollar canadian dollars like are you insane i left it right there i'm like i don't like fruits like that so i'm gonna just leave that alone because why well, i'm gonna buy a tray of grape a handful of grapes for ten dollars you got me you got me messed up i just got a little easy quick something and I bought KFC as soon as I got here. But the KFC that I got on Kansan Spring Road, it wasn't that great. Which is very disappointing. You know when you come to Jamaica, especially since I haven't been here in over a year. Like, I'm looking forward to the KFC. And it was so bad because I feel like they rushed the cooking of it. So the meat did not taste like it was cooked properly. It was just pink on the inside. I'm like, ew. And I feel like it gave me a little tummy ache because I went straight to the bathroom today. <laughs> like I said, this is one of them like super, super vacation -y type stuff. Like we're literally going to be here like we live here. Like we're not doing touristy nothing. I might go to the, oh, I might go to the river or the beach later in the week. But we're going to do, we're going to be like we live here type thing like very localized so i really didn't buy vacation clothes i just went in my basement and just picked up some summer clothes because you know it's like heading into winter in toronto so i already put out all my winter cool stuff so i had to go look through my um all the trips that i've taken already for the year and dug through to see like what we're gonna take i really don't have much of anything i did not plan this trip like it was just i'm here you know so um i want to go out to eat tonight i'm waiting for um yannick my best friend to get home from work so i'm gonna shower take out something cute to where i don't know where we're going i asked her to tell me like where's a cutesy place nice place in kingston that we can go eat so that's what we're gonna do face is cute there is together we're going to this italian restaurant to eat my little cutesy outfit i'm trying to decide if i'm wearing this shoe or should i put on my hermes sandals <laughs> <laughs> Yanni poo. Yanni poo poo. We're going to this restaurant, this Italiano. Mambo Italiano. And we're gonna have us a cutesy time. I'm not even up there, sir. You have to go really, 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 really expensive to get bread. Exactly. We're not gonna get them together. What are we getting, Yanni? We can Olive oil, my love. 
We are gonna get a lamb trap, but people like serve lamb. Some people serve lamb trap very small. So that's a tree look or something. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm having Mediterranean shrimp thing in my jig. <laughs> Pasta in my face. Sausage. Oh, sausage. But I think it's still beef in it. Or is it pork sausage? Mm -hmm. Bon appetit. Um, I'm running some errands with my friend because he don't want me to stay in the Airbnb all day. So he's dragging me around. My hair is so cute. Like, honestly, uh, I don't know how to feel about my hair because I haven't done short locks in so long. And I'm like, it's cute, but I don't know if I loved it, but it's cute like she is so very cute oh. Oh. i thought you were in action yes i was in action i am in action uh -huh. can you say hello hey vloggy hey, hey, hey vloggy <laughs> hi this is Shay. welcome to my youtube channel you know YouTube. who i end my vlogs let me say uh, are you one um mm. uh, mm. Be, be beautiful people. Jovan, come on. You got it. Where's your only five seconds every day you watch first? You don't no, even know yeah. what the ending looks like. Then say if you watch 10 seconds, you make money, you know, so. Yeah, but so you have to see the end part of it. It's more on big up on yourself. Yeah, you're running anything there, you see me? Yeah, but you can't, you don't know, you can't so help you somebody. Give some, you can't give some people some advice about your... So when I give them money? Yeah. Let's do that already. I say, I have a health guru, fashion guru, hair guru. We you say, I know all I tip. When they dry and yep. everything. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sierra come in me for you? Yeah, man. All the time? Every time. Sure. Yeah, sure. guru, you know, none can contest. Oh, gosh. Best thing the best. Time, no? Sure. Not America. Mm-mm. Make up on a car. All right, I'm sorry. You go copy No, no. <laughs> so we're having fried chicken, rice and peas, and macaroni. Mm-hmm. I'm about to snatch all of this food up. Eat it up because what? Look at our fried chicken. Jesus. Mm. Mm hmm. We got jelly in a bag, coconut water in a bag. Boy. I didn't Mm just at earth, yeah? I it Good content this. Two million that views is easy. And <laughs> hey, put me in a video. Let me get to a joke. Ain't no funny. Ain't no funny. It is the weekend and we're doing a little girls trip up north. Trippy trip. A little trippy trip. A girls trippy trip. A little beach day. And we're going to Ocho Rios. It's kind of like midday right now, but with a highway, how long is it to get there? Like a hour. Hour and a half. Hour and a half. We're gonna go um the beach. We need some nice food. Can road. I'm on my seat, mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm almost there. Out of bag. Continue on yeah. Russell Heights for one kilometer. So we're going to go to where you see them? The cove. The cove. The cove in Ochi. I just like I'm a little chill, cute CDM, you know. So we're all in our cutesy fit. Cutesy fit <laughs> for the beach. So we're ready to have a time. Are we gonna eat before we like grab? Food they have a meal there. I don't know. So you all will just wait until we reach here yeah. and then we go. You walk me in if you want like a party or something. Well, no, a party. What do you think? Yeah, you could. Yeah. A party. I have a barman too. Turn right onto Grand's Pen Road. Okay, a party always. I'm young. Let's see. Um. <laughs> what do I want? <laughs> what do I want? I'm too sugary. Yeah. The amount of soda when I drink, I'm going to stop drinking soda and them something there is crazy. Yeah, I'm going to drink. Gatorade. What should I do? Yeah, I should probably get it. Apple juice. But the thing is, Gatorade is full of sugar. I'm going to get Gatorade zero. So I'm going to drink too much sugar Gatorade too. I'll just get one something there. Water. I'll take both of them and I'm going to go one. <laughs> <laughs> what is this, honey? I don't know. I have a pot and shit. 
Is it salted? Yes, yeah, slightly salted. Oh, that kiss cupcake is so long. That mask still tastes good? Yeah, no, cupcake. Or which one tastes better? The cupcakes are that. I prefer this. Oh, but the orange. I'm gonna like orange flavor though. Yeah, you know, I'm gonna like orange. Yeah, me to the strawberry. Mmm. Get a kiss cupcake. Thank you. Let me grab it. What do you think about the ad? Which part may I go? go. Like as in dry? Yeah. If they're coming through, you got it. By Raja World. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I know the song, yeah? Sinful. I don't know the song, I should teach me the song, yeah? Mm -hmm. I'm just trying to get wild out tonight. What's your way out of the way? What's your way out of the way? I said, I'm going to put it by this lookout area it's so nice but why do i feel stuffy need some salt water for wash off for sale i put my foot in there but that's the most you're getting from me my feet in the water we got fried fish rice and peas brown stew sauce and festival we eating good tonight, ladies. Yeah. Mm -hmm. People, do you like, like it? Yes. I got an H and M like so long ago. Put on glasses, let me see. Put on glasses. Put on glasses. Wait, it's yeah, we popping, <laughs> guys. Look at this. Look at this. She moved from a ten to a twenty. 
God damn. <laughs> ah, ah. <laughs> My heart though, I get hot now. Yeah. But see my legs sweating. Like really bad. You still wear the car. Yeah, like, it's me and the legs. <laughs> it's hot under there. Why am I like, locks could I really fit me? Fit you. Well, it has to be this way. This Anything way? this way on you? Yeah. Fits. Yeah, that's what I got in my bob. <laughs> Oh my god, look at me. Like, I'm getting ready right now to go home. My flight is at 4 30, it's 9 a.m., and we're packing to leave. It's a bittersweet moment every time you gotta go home. But here's my dilemma. Here's my dilemma. It's my first time wearing these Hermes sandals, right? And this is what the back looks like. Mind you, last night, I didn't even go anywhere that was like hard pavement, rocks type shit, right? It just seemed like regular, regular asphalt, road, and dirt. You know what I'm saying? Why does these sandals, as designer sandals, chip so easy? Like the back of the shoes and around the rim is so badly chipped after the first wear like i got she in slippers that barely have scratches on them so for designer shoes to cost this much this much money and they really aren't made of like outstanding material they really aren't because i'm like really pissed right now because why is the front so jaggedy i wore these yesterday to brunch y'all saw where we went for brunch why why the slippers look so niam up niam up and stay bad like this shit don't make no sense are these type of sandals only supposed to be worn on soft ground just carpet and tile is that it because a little walkie walkie on the side walkie shouldn't be doing the sandals all stuff like this it's 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 ridiculous how the front looks look at the front that's crazy that's crazy I don't, I don't i don't i don't get it i don't get it i had these gucci slides for years and th these 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 things are sturdy like these are fire shoes you know what i'm saying like these shoes have not chipped ruined come apart and <laughs> nothing do you see how big these shoes are these are some hefty duty shoes they're bulky as hell but they're super cute and durable that's what I'm going to start doing. Forget all that dainty shit for all that money. If the shoes ain't built like this, I don't want it. Okay? I don't want it. Chef B, one going beautiful people, <laughs> washing off our hearts with the jelly. 
Why is it like a um, this to rich and go for Leave me alone, party. Clean up the heart, I tell you, man. <laughs> Clean it up. You can't see any left purely. You all in a white. Mm -hmm. I see you, like, you know. White. I'll give them a fit. I'm going to be a new person. Yeah. A holy person. Yes. Like my soul. Tastes good. Want one more? Mm -hmm. What make? I'll give you something to eat. You can't do it, you know. I'm going to hire you still, be a cameraman. Yeah. I'm nice. I'm, I think I'm doing a good job. So? Yeah. So? Come like it, look. Say, so I taste the pine too. You want me to taste the pine? Yeah, everything. Yeah. My people them come a fire, man. Tell them, I'm a kind of European. You mean? One stop when it comes to jam down. Where are you from? I'm going to bring stretch because I'm trouble. I'm going to shovel. Yeah, so you never get a jelly today, you know? Yeah, when I've been there, I don't like to scrape with everything. Can I leave some for your dog, man? Make your dog get some jelly today, man. <laughs> I scrape with everything. So what we know, Yeah. This right here is a pineapple. Say, so I think it's the world, you know, say a pineapple, like. Right? <laughs> That's good. Sweet. I don't think I eat pineapple after. Eh? But I'm not going to But them things are good for your party. You see, I tell you this morning, anything is good for you, you know, like. I'm not going to lie. For, for your trip, I think are the, are the healthiest ever eat from, from me here. Easy, man. Come in. And we're out. Oh, you go. Boom. Hey. <laughs>